Okay, here it is so far. It's behind me. We're not going to see the plain old white walls because I thought I was taking video and I was taking a picture. So, imagine it just plain white walls. Nothing else in there currently. So we have eight feet this way and 10 feet this way. Um, I was hoping to be able to move these two this way and bring that that way into the corner and I could put three here. It would fit, but I am a quarter inch short on the eight foot wall because of this molding. It is four inches wide and it is on my side of the booth. So I'm losing four inches here of my eight feet to put in shelving. So I need to clarify and ask if if this has to stay, because the other side of the booth, as you can see, is using that wall as well. So the other thing is I have about 32 inches here, but I have this molding right here that will make something either stick out an inch or be an inch shorter for this wall. So that's what we're dealing with for so far. Mom is, um, so mom is getting a couple of bookshelves emptied out from her house that we can bring over here, but we still have about a week before we can even bring, um, merchandise in, but we have a week to keep putting in shelving and figuring out what we want to do with the other walls. So that's where we're at for now. See you guys soon. Hey guys, just a little booth update for you. So here is where I'm at right now. I brought in this farmhouse cabinet. Rearrange the center section, put my shelves over here with all mom's Beanie Babies and McDonald's toys. And this is what we currently have for how full my booth is. Now I'm going to take the plate stand that was right in this corner here. So here, let me, I'm going to spin you back around. So the plate stand was underneath here, which was great, but I'm going to take it right here. We're going to take it down to mom's new booth and see how it looks down there. Brought over, put the shelf in here and put the plate stand on top of it. I'm able to go out to the edge of the carpet here. So the wall is kind of about, I don't know, six inches in. So it does stick out a little bit, but it's as close as we can get there. So that's what got accomplished for today next up we brought in these three bookshelves from mom's house so the brown and then the two narrow ones next we're gonna bring in there's another three foot one that mom has and looks like we're gonna still have to find another I don't know three four feet of something to fit on the end here we brought in several boxes that we'll be putting out on Wednesday and um, then we'll see how full we can get this because Right now, we got quite a bit of shelving to fill up, and I'm certain those six boxes are not going to do it yet. So, I have unloaded eight boxes, six here in the new booth, and two in mine in the corner. So, that's what six boxes looks like. I think we're going to need about 30, 40 more to fill this one up. I'll catch up on the next update. Hi guys, it's Becky. Here we go. Been in year round. I found two new shelves um, just today, Friday. So we are two days, third day into having this booth officially open. And I got this short shelf here and I got this darker shelf here. And it is almost exactly the same as that one that came out of mom's house. It's funny as it says it's made in Denmark in the back of it. So that's pretty cool. I did switch this to the other side because I feel like it kind of blocks the um, cabinet space on this side a little bit better. See, it's a little bit taller versus where this one would have shown his stuff through over the top. And then I won't have a problem with anything tipping over off the back of this shelf. We'll have the security of the wall for that. So. Mom's been pricing. She says she has four or five boxes for me to pick up. I have to go pack a few more today, and we're going to unload some more and have it keep filling her up. See you soon. Okay, here's what we brought in today. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, basically eight, nine, ten, twelve boxes. Most of that is coming into the new booth. 
Let's see how it looks. Okay, here's what it's looking like. Bring it around. That shelf is empty, but it at least has a little bit of something on almost all these shelves. A few random things on this side. This is still empty, but this is what the 12 boxes did for us today. So we'll just keep working on it, keep filling it up. Hi guys, so here we are. Um, a week in, so I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 14, 15 boxes to unload today, and a piece of stained glass that went right here on the end. So, we're going to work on it, and I will show you what it looks like after filling it up for one week open. Okay, here it is. This is what it looks like after filling for one week. So I did six boxes last week, then 12 and now 14. So what, 32 boxes total so far. I have a lot of um, space still, but the glass looks really good. It's pretty much filled in. And the bookshelves are starting to look that way. I probably will need to pull some plates and put them in here eventually. But this is what it looks like. It's a great start for one week. I don't think it's too bad. Let me know what you think, guys. Thanks.